Okay, what's up everyone? So today I wanted to <clears throat> do something a little bit different and talk about my roster. Um, this is a little bit for me to see my progress, but also you guys to kind of see what champions I'm working with, uh, who are my best options and everything, because those kind of always influence uh, my decisions when I give advice or what characters I talk about. So what we're looking at right now is last year's. Uh, this is a video, it's my third video of the channel, and it's still available to watch if you're interested. Um, biggest thing to note is I'm still level 57. Uh, I had one 5 star uh, R4, and I had 13 um, maxed 4 stars. That's like 12, isn't it? Yeah, that's, that's 12 maxed uh, 4 stars. And this is today's roster. Massive change. Uh, biggest thing, one R5 5 star, three R4 5 stars now, uh, two of which are duped. Uh, four 6 stars, I was, because that was in January and I got my first 6 star uh, February, I would have been at uh, 7,500 shards, 7,500 6 star shards. But that's about where I am now, if I were to 100% the event quest, but I'm taking my time on it. Um, uh, right now I have 26 maxed 4 stars. Uh, I had characters like Medusa and Voodoo up there, but I've most recently Wasp, Taskmaster, uh, Archangel, Angela, Ghost. But I've also done a little bit more with my 5 star roster in general. Modoc, Carnage. Panther and Morto all going up to R3 as a 5 star, uh, which is good because previously I only had one R4, one R4 5 star, and then one R2, and the Hood, who has been R2 forever, and other than that, everyone else was 110. Um, I had, I believe it was 20, oh no, it was 16, four, 16 5 stars at that time, one of which was good, and that was Quake, and I had Morto unduped. And now I have 42 5 stars. And the main reason for this is just spending a lot of time on the game and less time in other games. Uh, one, of my, one of my things is that I played this game uh, relatively slowly at my own pace. It took me about a year to get my first 4 star. Um, and because of that, I'm like, uh, progress has been extremely slow. I still have not 100 pin Act 4, um, but I have done first clear of 5 4. Um, so I do things a little differently. I've done first clear of Labyrinth. I did that with Spark um, around uh, July, somewhere, somewhere in there. Uh, so 42 5 stars. Uh, I have characters like Hulk and Archangel, who I really should be trying to rank up. Most recent is Old Man Logan. You all saw that open, God, and uh, Spider-Man symbiote uh, right before him. Um, as for like catalysts and that kind of stuff, uh, I'm on a good amount of tier two alphas, almost eight again. Uh, I'm waiting for a cosmic and scale because uh, I really need those at R four next. Uh, I want to have a full six team of different classes. Uh, the only thing that would have broken that would. You can see I have the skill, tier 4, so you see I don't have the tier 3, but it's whatever. Um, you and I have a lot, again, I can recommend Mute and Cosmic, I have enough. Plus I have a massive amount of tier 4 CC, uh, and some tier 3 CC fragment crystals. Uh, just to show really quickly. Uh, three of those, over a thousand tier 4 CC crystals, and 14 tier 4 CC crystals. So, just to show my progress in quests a little bit, I'll go into story quest first, and you can see I have done 100% on Act 5, uh, Chapter 1, I done halfway through chapter 2, but I am stopping there because taking out the collector multiple times is difficult. 
Uh, I've done a couple runs extra here and there on 5-3. Um, I actually enjoy the, uh, keeping it one class, because uh, it's, def it's definitely the one I normally do, and then I've done 100% of the first chapter. First quest on chapter 4, and I've been working on that relatively slowly. Act 4, a uh, semi-similar deal, but I've done less, hundred, less random 100% here. And there, um, but I don't major maestro. And then everything else is 100%. Um, I am slowly working on this with the two energy per tile, just because these rewards are basically crap to me. That's that's one of the problems, one of the reasons why I have been pushing for it. 3k 5 star shards is nothing. 4 star shard, 4 star generic, tier 3 CC, I don't care for. And it's difficult for me to 100% just for the tier 2 alpha and the mastery point, although I w I'm trying to get one other mastery point to get my Mystic Dispersion up to R3. Um, I did Realm of Legends back when I had a 440 Star Lord, uh, 4 star, and now I've done it like five times just with no potions, just for practice against different champions. I have done first clear a Labyrinth. Um, that did, that gave me like a Wardo dude and something else. It wasn't that great uh, for me at the point. I did it with Spark. I ended up spending quite a few units on revives and that kind of stuff. So it wasn't exactly what I wanted to do at that point. Uh, and because I showed Quake at the beginning of at the end of the last video, I want to show her again real quick. Uh, she was 446.60. Now she is 550. 565, say 160. Uh, she was 5, 5, or 455, because I hate the levels on 5 and 6 stars. It sounds so much better to say 560s, 550. Uh, just, she's basically, her attack has gone up, her health I gained almost 10k. Uh, health, which she was at 20k after 7. Uh, attack to that 2100 to 20. And her second ability was not too much. She was block additional 30% damage. That ends up block efficiency at 90%. Yeah. Average, obviously. It's not going to be like completely there. She's going to block the 60% and then she's going to block that 30% or whatever. But yeah, so that is my roster now. Um, progress has definitely sped up since I tried. Um, I still consider myself semi-casual. Uh, one of my favorite things about the game is something I'm not casual on. It's just exploring a character's abilities. Uh, those are absolutely my favorite things. Um, Ghost, I ranked up for that. I actually awakened her. You know, Spider-Man Spark has been unawakened and ranked 5 since last year's video. Um, so, I haven't done a champion video in a while, so Ghost is going to win the next one. I want to do an in-defensive Doctor Strange, maybe a Daredevil as well. Uh, one thing I didn't talk about, uh, Awakening Gems. I use the 4 Star Awakening Gem on Ghost. Um, 4 Star Awakening Gems don't do much for me anymore. You can see I have 3 class and 1 generic, and I have 2 5 Star Awakening Gems. This this Cosmic I got my first third Labyrinth. I have not used it on Carnage. I don't think I'm going to. Uh, he's not exactly what I'm looking for in character right now. Uh, my main thing to look for is Heimdall and Killmonger, just so that I can have a uh, true strike champion for being ready. So. so yeah, that's my roster. Hopefully you enjoy this. If you see anyone that I didn't talk about that you want me to make a video on, let me know. So all these characters, I consider myself <clears throat> well enough versed in to make a video, and many others as well, such as Saber to Killmonger. Uh, some basics on Heimdall, Domino. Uh, so let me know about that, and thank you for watching.